What's up ghouls? It's Blaze and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Spooky Box Club unboxing for you guys. I'm so excited. It's been so long since I did a Spooky Box Club unboxing. I, I thought they'd forgotten about me, but no. So I just sat down to record and I'm looking at the package thinking that is fucking massive. Um, so this is how big the package is. Like it's huge. And I was like, oh my God, have the boxes got bigger? That's crazy because the normal size of a box in comparison to the package is like, like that's a big ass box. So then I start opening it. There's two in one. I'm so excited. Okay, so the two boxes we have to unbox. The first is Gothic Globetrotter. And that is box 30 and or 31 I can't remember and then the next box is glamour ghouls so um chronologically it's gothic globetrotter first so I'm going to start with that and it feels mega heavy compared to this one so I'm very excited um I'd have to say in terms of like the theme of the box I think I'm more excited for glamour ghouls but we'll see okay so we have our card as usual, which I'm not going to look at. Then we have all of these things that Pumpkin loves to attack. And the confetti is little like fuchsia bats that are metallic y and cute. So, oh my god, okay, let's just go right in. Oh, that's the biggest thing. I'm not doing that first. Okay. So the first thing I've pulled out is a teeny tiny patch and it's a little diamond shape and it says best vacation ever. It has little skulls on it. That's so cute. Oh, I love it. Oh, I just love spooky box colour. Just... Okay, so the next thing is a charm for the charm bracelet. This is so adorable. It is a little silver, oh I nearly dropped the box. A little silver spider with a purple little gem. It's just so cute. Everything's so like cute and creepy, but dainty and delicate and like, oh, I'm just so obsessed. That is so cool. Okay, so it is a Batty Coffin luggage tag or yeah, um, I'll open it up for you. So you can like obviously pop this on your suitcase or your bag whenever you're traveling. So it's like a coffin and then a bat and then you can put your name, your address and your telephone number. Oh my god, it's just so gorgeous. It's just so cute. Like everything is so perfectly fitting within the theme. It just looks super cool. It's good quality. I can't literally, I can't love Spooky Box Club enough. <laughs> Next we have a lollipop. Um, I don't think it, it doesn't actually say what the flavour is, but it's um, so it's yellow, orange, and green. Very very colourful lollipop. Then we have Spooky Locations Luggage Labels. Okay, I'm excited to see this. It's got like a little print and it's got a skeleton and he's got them stuck on his little suitcase. So that's pretty cute. The first one is a triangle with the bones and it says, get lost in Bermuda. Oh, they smell like new shoes. Then we have Loch Ness, Beautiful Scotland. That's so cute. That is my aesthetic right there. Okay, I'm not sure how you pronounce that, but it's a place in Japan. I got bit in Transylvania. Oh my god, that is the cutest one. That I am 100% in love with that. I want to go to Transylvania so bad. Then there's Ancient Egypt. These are so cute. Like, oh, I just love it. And then Death Valley National Park, and there's a little UFO. Cute, beam me up. Oh my god, okay, these are so adorable. They're just, oh, I can't, I'm done, I'm done. Okay, next up we have a cobweb luggage strap. Oh my goodness. Is so good I don't know if you've ever been to like baggage reclaim or whatever you call it and there's everything's going round in the conveyor belt and you've just got like a little black suitcase and it's like I don't know 
I could be walking away with a bag full of Killstar and Kat Von D or a bag full of MUA and Topshop. But now you're not going to have that problem because you can put this hella cute strap over it and you'll be like, that's my spooky bag right there. That is just so cute and it's adjustable so no matter what size your bag is, you can pop that on. Like I honestly don't travel that much, I mean I don't even have a valid passport so I won't be travelling anytime soon. But I'm definitely going to keep this for when I travel. Hopefully beginning of next year I'll be going to either Germany or France, I'm not sure yet. Um, but that's still like up in the air, who knows, I need to sort my passport out. Anyway, next up. This looks very, very promising and very, very cute. Oh my god, I think I know what this is. Okay, if ever there was a reason to get my passport, this is it. It is a passport holder, it's just black, I think it's faux leather, I'm not sure, I hope it's faux leather, um, with a silver crescent moon on it. And so it holds your passport in there and then it says Spooky Box Co on the back. Like, can you imagine just, you know, walking through, going to check in, and it's just like, oh, do you have your passport with you? One second, just pull it out of your bag, like, oh, here. I love this. It's, I just love things that are like, they're practical, but they're spooky and creepy. And it's just like an everyday thing, but it's spooky. Like, there is literally nothing better in my life than Spooky Box Club. Okay. Ooh, cute. Okay. So it says the last thing is a witchy travel shoe bag. That's obviously the packaging. So I'm gonna cry. This is like this is so adorable. Look at that. And so your shoes don't get damaged or they don't, you know, you don't get any dirt or anything on other belongings. I, I want this as a print on my wall, I want it as a tattoo, I, I just want to look at it every day, like... Is it lame to make this a cushion cover instead? Because like, I'm in love with the art on that, like that is... Oh, it's just so cute! Oh my god, okay. Spooky Box Club is the one. It is the one. So that is everything from the Gothic Globe Trotter box. So it was box number 31, we got our custom made dark voyage passport cover, custom made witchy travel shoe bag, custom made cobweb luggage strap, custom made batty coffin luggage tag, custom made spider bracelet charm, custom made best vacation patch, custom made spooky luggage labels and a handcrafted gourmet lollipop. That is everything. That was like the most adorable box of my life. Like every time I get a box, I'm like, oh, this one's my favorite. And then I get another one and then that one's my favorite, but I just can't cope. It's just all so cute. And the best part is now we're going on to another box. This is so fitting because it's my birthday in like two weeks or just under a, a week, I don't know. My birthday's in, what day is it? Eight days, my birthday's in eight days. So it's like I'm getting my presents already. So box number two, Glamour Ghouls. I'm so excited. I just know I'm going to love everything. Oh, I'm already feeling it. So the card is green. I love green. Okay, right. Focus, please. Focus. Oh, these are attached right in there. I can't cope. Oh my god. Okay, so the first thing I've picked up is a nail stamping art plate. Okay, so there's like a little plastic card thing and a little beaker. Um, instructions, select your desired pattern from the spooky mixing stamping plate, paint over the design with your chosen nail polish, scrape off the excess polish by holding the scraper at a 45 degree angle, use the stamper to pick up the polish, roll the stamper over the nail. Oh, so it's just like doing your own nail art. Okay, I'm down. So it comes in like this really cute little pack, like even the art on the pack is cute. And you open it up and you've got this thingy which has all the designs on. Just appreciate those designs for a moment there. Like <sighs> so cute. I am like so awful when it comes to fiddly things like that. So I'm hoping that I can practice and get better or convince my sister to do it for me. But either way, so cute. Okay, next up. 
I don't want to say that because I just know I'm going to say it wrong. It looks like it says cognac, but that's alcohol, so I don't know. Soft facial sponge? Conjac? Con I don't know. So you rinse it under warm water before each use. Add your facial cleanser if needed. Massage your face in circular motion to exfoliate. And then gently squeeze out the water. That's so cute. Oh, it feels really hard. I'm really scared to use this. Like, I have really, really dry skin, so I don't know if this is going to be the best thing, but I'm definitely going to give it a go. But I do really need to exfoliate, so... Oh, it feels so weird. But yeah, that's what it looks like. I'm excited to try that. Oh, there's two things. Okay, let's start with this one. So I have something here in a pouch. Oh, cute. Okay, so it's a necklace. On the back it says Spooky Box Club. This is going to be really awkward to show you guys, but it's like a necklace here. So gorgeous, but it is a mirror. So there you are. There's you guys. Look how good you look. Oh my god, did you do something different with your hair? <laughs> but yeah, that's what it looks like. It's so gorgeous. Oh my god, that's so cute. Love it. I guess that's why it was in bubble wrap. Oh my god, can you imagine if that got delivered, like broken, if you like? seven years bad luck so the next thing I have is another charm for the bracelet oh that's so cute so it's a little little teeny tiny cobweb and then it will like match with the spider charm that you got in the last box that is absolutely adorable okay so the next thing that I've picked up here looks like and um, so it looks like a little silicone oven mitt you can pop your hand in it there and it's got all these different textures and i'm pretty sure that is for cleaning your makeup brushes on and it's cute and purple and in a little heart shape that is very very cute and very useful Ooh, cute okay teardrop blending sponge duo and they are latex free so anyone with an allergy can still use these so it's two like beauty blender style things, you've got a bigger purple one here and a teeny tiny black one. Oh my god, look at it! So cute! And that'd be really good for like under eye, around the nose, stuff like that. I'm so excited to use these. This is just like the best box of my life, like I'm such a makeup person and it's just all makeup-y and cute. Oh my god, this is the best thing I've ever received in any spooky box club. Ever. Okay. Let me open it. Oh my god. Okay, so it's a little pin and it says Living Dead Girl. And it's black and green and sparkly and the font is cute. And I just want to wear this every single day of my life. I just want to like pin it here so I can just wear it forever. Oh my god, that is just so cute. Like I'm 100% obsessed with this pin. That is, if I were a pin, I would be this pin. Then we have our lollipop, and this one is yellow and pink. Super, super cute. And then the last thing we have on the bottom, oh, that's so cute. And it is a makeup bag, and it says, magical supplies may contain evil spirits. So cute, and I'm hoping it's faux leather. Um, woo! Oh, that's good. So there's like a strap inside. So you can pop it on the little tiny D-ring there. So if need be, you know, you can hold it, you could take it out. I guess you could even use it as a clutch on a night out if you really wanted. Um, and it's just so cute. Oh, it smells new. So yeah, it's pretty spacious inside. Like at the moment, I don't have any kind of like makeup bag. I don't know why, I don't know where they've gone. I had some before I moved house. So when I've been staying places for like just one night, I've been using this aerial handbag as like my little travel makeup bag. Just keep the essentials in. So now I can upgrade. So let me just double check the card. So Glamour Ghouls Box 32, custom made spell essentials makeup bag. Yes, that cognac, cognac, whatever, facial sponge, yes. Custom made spooky nail art stamping kit, yes. Custom made web bracelet charm, customized teardrop blending sponge duo, custom made living dead girl pin, yes. Custom made magic mirror pendant, purple heart brush cleaner, and a handcrafted gourmet lollipop, yes. Like, oh, these boxes, I can't wait till Jake gets home. I'm gonna be like, look what I've got. <laughs> 
But yes, that was super, super cute. I love everything I've got, especially that pin. That's like my favorite thing of my life. That is going straight on Instagram. <laughs> yes, so that is everything for this double spooky box club unboxing. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching it. And as always, if you are interested in spooky box club or any of their social media, it will all be linked in the description box. If you have any questions or you just want to chat, I don't know, whatever, then please comment down below because I'd love to hear from you guys. Um, like and subscribe if you want to be a true. <laughs> and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!